Let's go. We're gonna play very safe here, Chad. Naked Zhao, nah. What is Lagmog like Zhao doing? It gives you more range and a bit less dispersion. It used to also give you, um, what is it called? Uh, better rudder shift, but they removed that one. I still see all these beautiful CVs of snowflakes, yeah. And you will keep seeing them. No, actually you won't keep seeing them when we're done to moving to tier 9. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yo, Iowa, let's go, bro. It's time. And we won't discover the snowflakes. Oh, that's pretty cute. Good. Let it burn. Wow, he actually got a citadel. How rude. Bro actually got a citadel. How rude. In his Tulsa, man. New player. How do you angle your aim when you zoomed in? Seems like you're looking more above than I do. Uh, that's because I'm using a spotter plane. You, Without a spotter plane, you look like this. You see like this, but I'm using a spotter plane. That's why I can lift my... As long as this is active. When this is done, I cannot do it anymore. Mr. Fisher. Oh, no fire prevention, Iowa. Interesting. You're welcome. Oh, that's a dead sub gamer. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> well, ripped submarine unless the people can't aim. Yeah, yeah, I want to say boom. Bro got completely annihilated. I want to be greedy. Yeah, I'm gonna block this with the corpse. I'm afraid Rupert might eat them, but we'll try. I don't think that's how he plays that. No? Top angles are really sad. They are. They are. I agree. But at least the torps are still better than some other torps on cruises. I'll go already on the other side. Zhao is still fun. Zhao is still okay to play. Yeah, it is. I mean, the guns with the legendary, the accuracy is very good. You have enough range because you need the range. You don't want to be too close. I just missed the ridiculous rather shift on the legendary mod, which made it so important to get.
Well, we do not get that anymore. We don't get that anymore. Ports ah! I'm just kidding. We play reload Zao, yeah, but legendary is really nice. Again, the old legendary was insane. Four second what did you have? Four second rudder shift Zao? Like in DD, that was really dented. You could you you could dodge shell so easily with Zao, it was actually hilarious. Like people see you turning and you're like, no, I'm just gonna turn the other side. Also, we need to watch out. There's a Ruprecht coming soon. Best try MVP player, oh yeah. Come on Heisen, I know you wanna shoot. I'm probably gonna hit the Georgia. <laughs> but we'll see. I mean the rudder shift is still okay, don't get me wrong, but you can imagine how strong it could have been. Or how how good it was back in the day. I also love the original Des Moines, yes. It's still good. Again, yeah, both both these both back in their original state were super fun. But they're still good. At least they're not butchered completely. That new Albin leg mod looks great, it does. It actually does. Since they get it, since it also gets you six percent reload, you only lose six percent reload on the reload mod. But I'm also looking forward to Golden Line. Remember Zao of 9.8 consumer? Yeah, now it got 9.9. .9. It's a bit worse, but still okay. Online lag mod will be really strong. It will be really busted. I think so too. But I'm happy because I really like that that ship so much. So I can't even deny that I'm hyped for it. The game seems to have like a 0 0.5 input delay skill issue. <laughs> class, classic, classic skill issue. I would say Kappa. Where is everybody? You see mine on that's it though, okay.
Glue up here with memes, yeah. But a very strong meme, to be honest. Especially a triple diff just for fun and giggles. Have you tried the leg mod on Petro? I do. Or oh, I did. Sorry. It's decent for randoms, but I don't like it for... for. I mean, it's okay for randoms, but I don't like it too much. In a way that you lose the reload and tankiness, which is also like, eh. It's not bad, though. In the current meta of random... Like in ranked, I would prefer the reload module. In randoms, the legendary is kind of better because you can play it a bit more relaxed. Stay at the back. Would you recommend the Japanese cruiser line to anybody in 2024? Yeah, if people have nothing else to grind, sure. Like, I don't think Zhao is bad. Don't get me wrong. I don't think the Zhao line is bad. I just feel like there's so many better lines to play. It's the same with Shima and Gearing and so on. Well, but they, they're not bad ships. They're just old and got forgotten, kind of. And they're nowhere near as good as they used to be, because the competition now is just way bigger. Minor move to smoke, that's illegal. Oh no! <laughs> How rude! How rude of Mr. Minotaur. You can't see Glyne's got power crap. Yeah, exactly. Still good ships, though. Like, like you can you can make every ship in the game work, even a Yodo. It's just if you compare it to others, it's just straight up unfair, kind of. You know, if you know what I mean. DD also moving in a smoke screen, that's illegal! Castilla said smash. Basically the same with the Montana line, not a bad ship, but definitely better option available. To be fair though, Monty got at least a bit of love, you know. It's like, I'm gonna go, see you later, okay, see you later, man. At least Monty got some love, even though I still think it could use some more love. But it got already some buffs, you know, like, we're still waiting for Zao buffs or Gearing buffs or Shima buff. But no, I don't see anything. Like, I don't know, Gearing, a heal, maybe... Shima, maybe 100 meters less torp detection. Like, you know. Oh yeah, Zao got HP buff, true. Zao got HP buff. Yeah, I, that's true. Zao got quite some HP buff. But like Shima gearing, where? I don't know, man. 